Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be looking for some granitic pe pegmatites. So here's a look at some of the rock real quick. Got lots of muscovite on there and some of it has granite. So we have some like a granite dike here, pegmatite. And we have some schist nearby and we're going to enter into this attic here. So here's some of the rock. Got some garnets here and there that are poking out on it. Here's some of the rock. Lots of smoky quartz. Got muscovite. Um, there's garnet here and there poking out. Jesse and I are gonna check it out. Hopefully we find some good stuff in here. A little pocket. So this was a beryllium mine. They were mining uh, beryllium. And that's one of the compositions for um, barrel crystals. You need beryllium to be able to get to barrel. Some kind of a pocket. Got some large large muscovite over here you can see all the muscovite hopefully it's pretty dark my camera doesn't have a light built in on it but you can see muscovite reflecting in there maybe this was a pocket that got dug out some pretty silvery looking material there down into the deep who knows what we'll find beneath it's kind of creepy, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I've got to be careful. Oh, a little bit of water here. Oh, I should have brought my muck boots. You can see the thickness of the quartz here. Kind of see down. How far back does it look like it goes? Dude, I have no idea. I can't see it end yet. <laughs> so we've got quite a bit of water on the floor right now. Goes back quite a long ways. Don't think we'll be making it all the way down there today, but uh, one of these days. Got old boots with holes and our feet are getting wet, so no good. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it goes back quite a ways. Oh, hi. <laughs> didn't see you there. Oh, there's a nest or something right there? Yeah, I was looking at that. Probably a bear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so there's like this really fine looking granite. And then you got the biotite. A little bit of garnet, I think, right there. Broken. Big chunks of smoky quartz. Muscovite. Looks like we got a little bit of schist right here. Kind of a weak zone in the ceiling right here. That would have to be watched. A lot of rock right here that's kind of... Big seam. Muscovite. You see that? You got the big books of it right here. See that? We'll venture deeper in on another day, but right now we're going to just explore this mountain, see what we can find here. Looks like we got some biotite schist as well. He's the dragon guarding the mine. This is on the side of the adit. And we have lots of muscovite books, mica books, all the way up this face. You can see that. Right above the adit now, people have been digging around. Got more evidence of the pegmatite. Lots of feldspar with the smoky quartz. Got a huge chunk of muscovite 
quartz mixture with a big book of it on top there. And you got the schist. I believe those are tourmalines there. And we got the big muscovite books. I'm gonna break her open. Tourmaline? That's what it looks like. I think so. And you can see the needle-like structure there on this rock. It's a good sign. Here we have a pegmatite vein going through the granite. Granite down below. Got large chunks of feldspar and some muscovite and smoky quartz. Little vein of the pegmatite going through a finer grain granite. Found this weird looking rock here. Not sure what kind of mineral that is. Looks like there might be a vein of it here. Possibly. Got some schist. Oh. Oh, rail tracks. Rail tracks? Yeah. <laughs> it's a little cold. So see people have been scraping up down here. Yeah. Right, and then... Oh, okay. All just a bunch of garnet. Yeah. It's funny because I was like looking at like a tiny one over here like, ooh, look at that garnet. And then I looked up and I'm like, oh! <laughs> right there. You said there was rail track? It's right. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right there in a big pipe right running there. Yeah, but dude, look at that. You still can't see the end. <laughs> This goes back off ways, dude. Oh, come on. It's really soft rock. I think it's like a layer of schist or something, maybe? Right? Thick. Just gonna stick it in my pocket. <laughs> Even though I don't need it for anything. What kind of creepy bug are you? Gross. I think it was a murder vampire bug. Barrel right there. Just a small one. It's got a crack in it. Nothing too special. Here's the rock I just busted off. Deteriorates pretty easily. We found a little bit of barrels in there, um, lots of muscovite. So, composition of this mountain is granodiorite, I believe, with um, monzonite as well, and some other types of granite. You can see all the big old books of muscovite on there. How's it going? God, I just broke a rock and got so much in my eyes. Oh. It's going. Safety glasses. I know. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> just hit my head on the ceiling. Put it in there. Okay. I think that's a broken chunk of one right there. Really? Oh yeah, I see it, okay. So we've, we've definitely got some. Just need to figure out where they're better. <laughs> so Jesse just pulled out this aquamarine barrel. Right there, if you can see that. See the granite layer here. Pegmatite. 
Jesse's on a good pocket. He's finding the barrels. Oh, yeah. Did you <laughs> found another one? Yeah, they're from all, but they're there. <laughs> Over on this side, we have all this musk bite. Just loads of it. See all that? Muscovite and this quartz mixture. My headlamp's getting caught on the rock. <laughs> just, just, just noticed the barrel as we're getting ready to leave and he wants to pull it out. <laughs> I can't tell that's a... Wait, what? That's not it. Alright, so that'll do it for today. Hope you all enjoyed this short little video. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.